For less than 3.2, distributive property and factory, this is your practice packet. So we're on page number three. First couple questions are just straight up distribute. I'm going to draw the arrows on the first couple just to guide you. And then once we get to about question five, I'll stop doing that. So negative five times A and negative five times a positive two. Two times A and times positive four. So two A plus eight. Six times A and six times negative three. So I'm going to get six A minus 18. Four times A and four times a negative eight. It's going to give me four A minus 32. 7a plus 63, 2a plus 18, number 7 is 2a minus 16. For number 8, we have negative 7a plus 63. For number 9, we have negative 14a plus 14. In number 10, it looks like I didn't finish this problem, so we're going to skip this one. In number 11, we're going to have negative 12x plus 18. In number 12, we have 3a minus 24. In number 13, we're going to get negative 6m plus 10. Number 14, 3x minus 2. Number 15, 5x plus 4. In number 16, we're going to have negative 5x plus 6. 17, we're going to have 14 minus 4x. And finally, in number 18, we're going to have 7x minus 10. So those are all your distributive property practice. At the bottom, you had factoring practice. So we're factoring out the greatest common product here. So we're going to factor out a 4, and that'll leave us with x minus 4. Over here, we are going to factor out a 2, it looks like, which will leave us with 5x minus 14. And here we're going to factor out that negative 3, and we're going to get x plus 8. Factor out a 2, x minus 6. And down here we're going to factor out a negative 2, which will give us negative 3z plus 2. Oops, sorry, not a negative 3z, a positive 3z, because we want to have a negative answer there. If you just factored out a 2, you would end up with negative 3z minus 2 inside here. So either one of those would be um, acceptable. Same thing up here on number 21. If you factored out a 3, you could do negative x minus 8 inside parentheses then. And either of those would be acceptable. Number four, uh, 24, we're going to factor out the negative 5. So we're going to have z plus 4. Or if you just factored out a 5, you would have negative z and you would have minus 4 inside parentheses here. So that's it. That wraps up Lesson 3.2 Practice Packet.